Now, when does hysteroscopy become necessary uh, in an IVF treatment uh, cycle? Now, hysteroscopy just means uh, it's a camera procedure where a telescope or a camera is inserted into the womb, the uterine cavity, to visualize it for possibility of abnormalities and also correct such if there are some. You know, so the question is who needs them? When a gynecological scan before an IVF is vague, you may need hysteroscopy to visualize the uterine cavity because that is where the embryos are going to be deposited at the end of the day. When there are suspicions of growth from ultrasound scan, growths like polyps or even little fibroids in the uterine cavity or around the uterine cavity, you need a hysteroscopy. When there are histories of previous termination of pregnancy, either by evacuation or D and C and all of that, there's high chance that you may have some scars which may prevent implantation. You may need a hysteroscopy. When there is recurrent IVF failure without obvious reasons, hysteroscopy may be necessary. When there is also infertility that the cause is not very obvious, you may need hysteroscopy. So these are just few reasons why you could have hysteroscopy before an IVF treatment cycle. Remember, IVF has a lot of gray areas. And the more we clear those gray areas, the better chances we create for ourselves and the more explanations we have for, for negative outcomes in an IVF treatment cycle. Thank you very much. Like, come your way next time. Have a beautiful day.